Now let's have a look how to customize the Express keys in the Wacom Center. So the Cintiq Pro 27 comes with two sets of Express keys located in the grip area on the left and right side with four Express keys on each side. And if I go in the Wacom Center, click on Express keys, I will also see a schematic where I can see already the presets which is coming from the Wacom Center by default and I can now pick whatever Express key I want and change the settings. Let's have a change for the top Express key on the uh, left side which is default setting is app shortcuts and now the driver or the Wacom Center gives me a lot of different opportunities to do my own personal settings. So to make it easier for you we have all the recommended settings on top where you can pick it for specific applications like like some hard wired um, shortcuts for, for undo and also uh, zooming in, zooming out or if you don't want to use the Express keys you can also disable it. Furthermore you can emulate all the different mouse clicks like left click, right click, middle click, double click and then we have keyboard shortcuts and this is possibly the, the one you would use most because especially with the opportunity to use keystrokes you can store any keyboard shortcuts in your workflow to a specific express keys. And then we have a lot of more stuff like more tablet related ones, um, we have the radio menus and the on-screen shortcut, in this case the grid panels as well. Let's focus for this case on the keystroke. So as I said it's also part of the recommended settings so if I click on keystroke what is happening a small window pops up and it waits for a keyboard shortcut to enter to the system for example let's program undo on one of these buttons so what I would do now is I click on Control Z which is basically on Windows the undo command and I can give it a name by entering the label in this case undo and now I click on apply and what you can see here immediately it has taken over directly my new setting it shows me the label on top undo and it shows me also the related keyboard shortcut below so now I've programmed my top left express key with the undo command 